The old style console window used in Windows PowerShell version 1 is still around in version 2. It has some significant drawbacks, however. First, it only supports single byte character sets, which was a real problem for countries whose languages require the use of a double byte character set. They were basically locked out of using the shell in their own language. The console also supports no color coding, making complex commands pretty hard to read. There were no built-in graphical hints or cues to help complete command names, parameters, and so on. It was, after all, an entirely text-based environment. If you came up with a great command and wanted to save it, you had to copy and paste it into a script file, perhaps using Windows Notepad. You often had to edit what you copied and pasted to remove output, shell prompts, and so forth, which was time-consuming and could allow errors to creep into your syntax. Finally, the console window didn't feature any time-saving tools like script snippets, formatting tools, and so on. It was a very plain experience. It's still there if you like it, but in most cases, you'll want to use something a bit more full-featured. You might choose to work with the Windows PowerShell Integrated Scripting Environment, or ISE. This ships pre-installed in Windows 7, is an optional feature in Windows Server 2008 R2, and is included with the PowerShell version 2 download package for other versions of Windows. The ISE offers a basic visual environment for working with PowerShell. It offers both an interactive command line as well as a scripting area. And when scripting, you can highlight a block of lines and execute just those lines. That makes it easier to develop a complex command that can be more easily saved into a script file. The ISE is a very basic upgrade over the console window. It does support syntax highlighting, which can make complex commands easier to read, and it includes support for double byte character sets. It also includes very basic integration with PowerShell's new breakpoint based debugging, which you'll learn more about later in this video. Here's the PowerShell ISE. As you can see, command syntax is color coded for easier reading. You can run scripts in their entirety, or you can highlight a section of code and either right click or use a function key to execute just those commands. There are different layouts to choose from, some of which include an output window and a place to interactively type commands. Sapien Primal Script represents a significant upgrade over the PowerShell ISE and is a preferred environment for many PowerShell users. It supports multiple languages, which is useful if you're still supporting older languages like VBScript, JavaScript, Perl, Python, and so on in your environment. It offers complete color coding along with graphical hinting and auto-completion features, which save you time. An embedded PowerShell command line window gives you complete access to the interactive shell in the same window as your scripts. Scripts output and debug output are automatically separated into different panes for easier debugging, and a full set of debugging features are included. Script snippets help you program faster, and literally hundreds of other features help you work faster and more efficiently. Here's Primal Script. Along the bottom, you'll notice a PowerShell window, along with tabs for script output and debug output. A full set of debugging features are included. With the debugging toolbar show, just click to add a breakpoint. Then, when you run your script, you'll automatically stop on the indicated line. A variables window breaks down the variables that are defined, helping you see inside your script and spot bugs. Script snippets can be accessed from a graphical browser or simply by typing the snippet name and pressing Ctrl plus J in the script editor. These are a quick way to add constructs and complex code to your script, and you can add your own time-saving snippets to the environment anytime you want. There's even an integrated help browser that makes it easier to review PowerShell syntax and concepts while working on your scripts in another pane. The entire environment can be rearranged to suit the way you work. Sapien offers other tools that can enhance your Windows PowerShell experience. Primal Forms helps you construct graphical dialog boxes entirely in Windows PowerShell scripting language. This lets you build graphical scripts that are more approachable to less experienced users. You use a drag and drop interface and simply add the commands that you want to run in response to user events, like clicking a button. ChangeView offers a very straightforward approach to change control giving you a place to keep your scripts where they will be protected and where you will be able to revert to previous versions of a script if needed. Primal Merge lets you quickly compare and merge two versions of a file, 
helping you spot changes made by a colleague and incorporate those into your own versions of a script if desired. Primal SQL and Primal XML make it easier to work with data, whether it's stored in a relational database management system or in structured XML files. Finally, Primal Scope offers a standalone debugging experience similar to the debugging technology in Primal Script itself. Primal Scope can be installed on a server or other secondary computer, giving you a debugger in the same place where you run your scripts, without requiring an additional Primal Script license. A package called Primal Script Studio includes Primal Script as well as all of the tools shown here. You can learn more and download trial versions from primaltools.com.